Hey guys, welcome back to Dot Hack Mutation. Last time we beat the game, and now we're gonna go and do some of this optional stuff. So we have a goblin, a round of goblin tag to play. And from here on out, if I just can't beat the goblins, then I'm just gonna stop. Like I'm not really I'm not gonna go crazy trying to beat these goblins. So yeah. This is how it always turns out. I can't take this anymore. Okay. So, first things first, gonna go ahead and use a speed charm. Uh, off screen, I went into a low level dungeon just to. Oh my god, where'd you go? There you are. I went into a low level dungeon. Oh my god, camera! Stop that. Would you please stop? Thank you. Okay. Um. You are earth elemented, right? Um, anyway, I went into a low. Ah! Yeah, this is where I gave up. No, not doing it. Or maybe I should. Up. Oh. Yep. No, not doing it. Totally not doing it. Leaving. Come on. Okay. Yeah. No. Not doing it. She is magic tolerant. She is faster than I am, and she is constantly healing. No. Not doing it. No way in hell. Sorry, not doing it. Giving up on the goblins now. So, um, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, I need to go to the other server. That's right. Theta server. Or Delta, or Gamma, or Alpha, or Beta, or Sigma, or friggin' something. I don't know. Dunloirig! Now, I think this, um, I think this level is a sign reference. Oh, by the way, the virus is here as well. For some reason, everything gets tinted blue. You see, like this used to be just regular concrete, now it's blue. Don't know why. Anyway, I believe this level that we're about to go to is a sign reference. So, for those people who are familiar with sign, well, you'll like this. If I'm if I'm correct, I don't remember what this place looks like, but uh, bitter. Yeah, I think it is because it's like the aerial city. Oh, it's a protected area. Okay. Why would they... Huh? That doesn't make any sense. Let me guess. <laughs> the one I got from Ballsmung. So this is a useless virus core. Thank you, Ballsmung. Anyway. So now, go ahead and unlock this. And we'll see what we get. Also, I did actually save after, um, after I got some money. So I, uh... I went into that... Okay, what I was saying before, I went into a low-level area and got a whole bunch of weapons and sold them and made a whole ton of money. So I am back to 99 of most of my healing items. The only thing I'm not at 99 of is Mage's Souls, and I don't use that as much. Uh, yes, this is a, uh, a sign reference. Oh my god. Friggin' camera, work with me here, please. But yeah, the characters in sign visit an area that looks like this. So, yeah. If you've seen Sign, you know what I'm talking about. Now, there's no map, which is weird. So I guess I just gotta walk there. I think that's it? Yeah. But yeah, uh, I don't know if this is the same place, but this area looks very similar to the, to the place that the characters visit in Sign. So, that's pretty cool. Hey, wow, it actually is upside down. You see, that's like... A statue of a woman holding the wall up, but it's upside down, like, so she's putting all her weight on the top of her back. That's kind of weird. Okay. So, uh, let's go ahead and use a fairy orb. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, camera! I'm gonna strangle you with a cactus! Ugh! Oh, okay, it's just like a little silkworm. Whatever. Freaking magic tolerance, I hate you. You That is the most annoying thing in the game, that they can be tolerant to an entire type of attack, magic or physical. That's so stupid. No. Asshole. No. So I guess this is where I got the last few levels. Oh my god. 
Because I noticed that when I was checking the file, uh, my file, the last time I played through the game, at this point, I was level uh, 54. So I guess this is where I got those last few levels on my first playthrough. Uh, okay. Kiku Hya Kumonji. Okay. I, that's probably either a long, so, yep. Yeah. Oh, it's a heavy blade. Okay. That's weird. Rairaku. Danku. Wait a minute, I know why she has crappy weapon skills. It's because she's using Mimiru's weapon. What's up? Here, I'm gonna give it to here. You sure? There. Use that one. At least then you'll have decent attacks. Sorry, Mimiru, I would keep using your sword, but it sucks. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay. Skills, please. Earth tolerant. Oh thank you. See now at least I can friggin' kill you. Is that really smart to be dropping rocks when you're flying? That's kind of like a Pidgeotto using rock slide. It's like, what if your own one of your own rocks hits you? <laughs> Yay! Ooh, what's that? What are you gonna get? Here we go. Um, getting getting virus course after you've beaten the game. Oh wow, the same thing. Getting virus course after you've beaten the game is probably one of the best ways to. Oh damn! It's probably one of the best ways to uh, stock up on weapons and things or well I mean uh, cores and things so if you if you are actually playing one of these games and you're having trouble getting virus cores um just well I mean I don't know what I'm talking about never mind huh if you have all four of these games and you're playing through I would recommend doing that like get really far and then start grinding on them but what the hell am I doing? just ignore me I don't know it's it's like no, it's almost 1.20, it's 1.19 a.m. I'm tired, and apparently I don't think straight when I'm tired. So just don't, don't pay attention to me. Jeez. No. Yay, good timing, Mr. All. You are the greatest. Aha. I win. Can I get an F? I don't have any Fs. Stop giving me that, stop giving me an incredible sword, ass. Granted, it's nice to have that sword because I can just sell it and get a ton of money. Because in the next game, I'm pretty sure we'll eventually get access to a uh, a healing that's even better than this. Oh my god, a house golem? Okay. Whoa, he hit me, he hit me with death. Okay, skills, good thing I have this. Now, I remember this friggin... And no, wait, no, I don't remember this one. I remember that there's an enemy that's like, it's a big pile of sand that's physical tolerant. I think it's either in the next game or the last game. So, yeah. What do we got? Virus Core F, goody. Why did you turn into a scarecrow? That's weird. Yay. More. Good. Okay. So now I'll go and use a major soul on the straw. There we go. Ding. All right. Now let's go. At least I can tell where I'm going. That's nice. Ugh, I hate it when dungeons just are. I hate it when dungeons are so spread out that you can't tell where to go, and it, you potentially run into fights that you would have been able to normally avoid. Okay, black uh, Mistral, go to that. Get close. Jeez. Come on. Black Rose. Okay, here. Uh, no, no, no. Black Rose. Designate skill. Let's do something. Right. What the hell did you just say? She said Ryrak instead of Ryraku. What the hell? And she also said Dank. Instead of Danku. God. Man, they dropped nothing but this sword in here, I guess. Yay! I got it to hit everybody. Sweet. <laughs> I'm, I am consistently blown away by what Wendy Lee is saying every time she has a sword that has Japanese-sounding skills. Gah. Ryrak! Oh, God, it's a monkey again. Okay, Mistral, first aid. 
I mean, uh, whoops. Mr. All skills, my bad. I forgot I need to actually have her attack. Oh, and hey, you know what's good? Hang on, I don't need to use those because I bought I bought a bunch of wood spells in preparation for fighting the goblin, but, well, she's magic tolerant. So yeah, don't need to do it anymore. Like I don't need to save them, I mean. I'm not gonna data drain these anymore because I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to wind up killing myself with the data drain. Am I still on the first floor of the frigging dungeon? 50 experience, man. That's great. That's another thing. I'm really missing out on a ton of experience when I data drain them. So I need to stop. I've got plenty of money. And then there's always more to be made elsewhere. So yeah. Oh god. This is a kind of an extensive dungeon. Whoa, a wander demon? Uh, no, 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 skills. I think. Uh, of course, I don't have a water spell. Yay. These things are weird looking, man. God. Sucks that I can't use the, uh, the, the next level of goblin armor, but oh well. I'm going to go ahead and use Ola Repth, actually. Very rare that I do any healing, but yeah. I'm actually going to. Nope. Aha! Oh, here we go. Uh, no, I don't want to. I mean, I want to, but I'm not going to. Yay, there we go. Got like 100. Come on, 50. All right, that's fine. I'm just glad I didn't actually lose any experience from data draining. That's always the worst. When you data drain and then you have too much uh, viral infection and you lose experience. That sucks. Oh. Straw, first aid. Stop giving... God. You got magic tolerant and physical tolerant enemies in here. It's very obnoxious. Ah, jeez, Mr. All, be a little bit quicker, please. There we go, good. No. Quit that. Nope. I want antidote on Mr. All. Thank you. Boom. 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 Stop. Oh, God, you're such an asshole. Oh, I have nothing to say to you. Wait a minute, does he, is that a giant eye? It is a giant eye. Ew, that's gross. I can't believe it took me that long to notice it. I thought it was like his mouth or something. Okay, die. Thank you. 50 experience. Yay, and another level up. Two levels up. Man, I wonder when I'm going to level up. Uh, next. Or, I mean, uh, two more enemies. Oh, crap. Uh, he's got a tree on his ass. Okay, that's pretty funny, actually. <laughs> he has a tree growing out of his butt. I think that's supposed to be like his tail. Here, uh, let's see. See? Uh, there it is. It actually has, like, a house and a... He has, like, a farm on his back. That's actually really cool enemy design. I like that. It looks very cool. Okay, so use all these scrolls. Kind of makes me think of Shadow of the Colossus. At least a little bit. Even though they weren't that big, they weren't big enough to have, like, buildings on them. Or, they probably were big enough to have a building on them, but they never did, which was kind of a kind of a shame. You know, wouldn't it be cool if, like, the twist ending is that the last Colossus is, like, the planet Earth, and you have to go somewhere and, like, stab its head and kill it? <laughs> wouldn't that be funny? Alright, um, Astral, first aid. No. God, stop paralyzing her. God, so annoying. You're like any given monster in Monster Hunter that can actually cause paralysis. You're like that one. Oh, God. The standard combat is so boring when you can't do anything. There's no weaknesses to take advantage of, and you can't have a caster. Ugh. Like, if you're going to make it magic tolerant, at least give it some kind of weakness. That'd be really nice. Oh, and also off screen, I went ahead and gave Black Rose and Mistral more antidotes and more resurrects. 
because that close call against Magus made me think, man, what would have happened if they just happened to have run out of those? So, yeah. I went ahead and, give them, and gave them more, just in case that ever happens. And yay, level 52! Great. Do, 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 do. And the best part is that if you want to, you can use this area over and over and over again. It's just you're not going to get the, uh, you know, the reward. Oh, wow, that's it. Cool. Oh, thank God. I thought it was going to be like a 5-4 dungeon. Brown worm. Earth tolerant, huh? Okay. Skills. I'm going to use a thingy. Woods right. Rajukzot. Then Mona Marshall can get these pronunciations right. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> we both use the exact same spell, except I'm using a uh, scroll. There we go. I'm all out. Jeez, Black Rose is just getting her ass handed to her. All right. Good job soaking damage. Let the DPS take care of it. <laughs> all right. I guess I'm kind of like a paladin, because I can do flash heal. <laughs> Alright. Well, I mean, I know that more more than one class has flash heal. I'm just saying that, you know, I'm a fighter that can do substantial melee damage and heal a bit. Okay. Whoa, house golem again. Alright. Uh, skills. Alright, I have that. I have a wood spell. What am I doing? Skills. Spell. Juxot. Why would raising a tree under someone hurt? That doesn't make any sense. Or at least under an enemy like this. And besides, they're like little tiny trees. You know, like when you run into a tree in Pokemon that you have to cut. It's like one of those kinds of trees. Boom. Okay. Boom. Uh, I guess I'll go ahead and Data Drain. Because, oh wow, it's still pretty infected. Wow. Alright, well. I'll keep going. Man, even after all the enemies I've killed that I haven't been data draining, I I still don't have my data, like the infection still hasn't pissed off. Okay. Skills, done, done. there we go. Man, why does it take 20? It's not even a big spell. Like I said, yeah, it's level one. These are all the same. I guess tornado, drop lightning, raise trees. What's the difference? Why would raising rocks or whatever, it doesn't matter. Anyway, there's that. Now, oop, what'd he drop? Nah, just some stupid spell, that's what I thought. All right. So, Mistral, heal us up. And now I'm going to go ahead and uh, get ready for this last fight, because I'm sure this one's going to be uh, a doozy. All right, so, Age of Soul and Mistral. I'm not going to use one on me. All right, what do we got? There's something in the back. Okay. Well, what is it? Oh, shit, it's a portal! What the... It's acting like the boss of this ghost town. Whoa, that's so cool looking. What is it? Ooh. Angle more, okay. Ow, ow. Sword dancer! That's what it is. <laughs> Thank you. Ow, ow. Ow. Oh my god, that's one combo? I really wish they would use a Resurrect instead of using Rip Mean. That's kind of annoying. Oh, wait. Hang on. His attack is up. Can I... Maybe I have something that can lower his attack? Let's see. Hey! Oh, my God. Well, that's perfect. Huh. Maybe I can lower his attack. Wouldn't that be nice? Okay. Well. Come on. Okay, let's get Black Rose first. So you go over and start fighting. 
Go on. Okay, now I'll get Mistral so she can stay over here. Holy crap! It's like Sword Dancer on steroids, and I don't think Sword Dancer really needs steroids right now. Oh my god! His like whole his one combo can friggin' nuke somebody. Okay, healing potion on Black Rose again. And I'm gonna try to well his attack again. Uh no no no. Uh skills. Here we go. Deck core. Stop dodging it, man. I just wanna friggin' lower your attack. Is it impossible? Well, at least Mistral is doing good damage. Okay. Good lord. Jeez, man. Gotta use three friggin' healing potions on it. Uh, just to friggin' stop her from dying. Okay, Th this is not working. There. How about I just do that? <laughs> it's actually cheaper to let her die. Because one resurrect is cheaper than three frigging, what's it called? Than three uh, health potions. Nope, you missed. Man, this thing is crazy. You know, it kind of looks like a Mega Man villain. I don't know why I think that, but it kind of does. Here, I'm going to heal myself because I don't want to die. Ow! My god. Heal. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hello. It uh, doesn't matter if you're alive for this because I can just data drain and you won't get any experience anyway. So let's see what we get for this guy. So that'll be interesting. Man, he looks cool. Boom. Yay. I don't even care if I get a virus core. Crimson Raid. Cool. Alright, uh... Oh, she's already back up. Good. Die. Aha! My kill! <laughs> Yay! This is the thing that destroyed the city? Lucky shoes! Okay. So what, is that like the Persian boots or something? I mean, wouldn't it be nice if we get the Persian boots? Man, that'd be so cool. I love the Persian boots. If I ever had, like, sneakers, or, like, I mean, not sneakers, if I ever had, like, slippers, I would want them to look like the Persian boots. Because, well, I love the Persian boots. Don't you judge me. They're awesome. So, I'm going to go back to a server, and I'm going to check out these items. Because I, I assume Crimson Raid is a uh, dual blade. And, uh, yep, 24. Blazing Wheel, Twin Dragons, and Apvax. Okay, and Life Drain. That's not bad. And then Lucky Shoes. Hey, wow. Rig Same and Rig Game. Wow. Nice. That's pretty good. No damage. Possible possible chance of receiving no damage from enemy attack. Wow. Nice. It's not bad. Okay, good. I don't lose any what's it called. I don't lose any uh, accuracy. That's what I was worried about. Power boots and lucky boots. Hey, and I gain a lot. I gain attack and defense. I lose some evade though, but I don't care. There we go. Sweet. Okay. Oh, whoa. Oh, those. That sexy model. Check that out. That's so cool, dude. Now that's a twin blade. Oh. Okay, so that is the end of Dot Hack Mutation. There is nothing left of the game to show. So, I'm going to end it. Or, well, yeah, I, I'm ending it off just like any other game. So, I'm ending it. Next time, uh, it will be Dot Hack Outbreak. But I'm going to be taking a little bit of a break in between this game and Outbreak. I'm going to do a few other. I'm going to do a few games uh, in between this one and the next Dot Hack game to build up suspense and keep things hyped now that oh god the virus is spread to everywhere oh no so what will happen find out next time i decide to play dot so see you then